Today, a professional baseball player known for leading the Negro League was honored in Louisville. The monument for felt and snow revealed today at Eastern Cemetery. The Negro League's history in Louisville goes back to 1930. The Louisville White Sox played for years right here in the city before joining the Negro League as the Louisville Black Caps. Snow started his career in the White Sox here in Louisville before going on to play for the elite Giants and eventually managing teams. Snow was a two-time All-Star in the league, but he eventually came back to his roots working at the Hubbard's Lane Barbershop in St. Matthews, but until today he was not properly recognized with a marked grave. These players played in anonymity and even today they, they died and buried in anonymity. Let's think about this, 1974 when he passed away, 48 years ago. For 50 years this man has been in an unmarked grave. Louisville Slugger Museum will display an exhibit called The Best Black Team You've Never Heard Of. And then tomorrow at the Bats game, Snow's jersey number will be retired right before that game.